quick, graph y equals e to the x plus 1 by hand, two different ways. This is part of the family of functions series. First way is using what we call the e to the x dance. y equals e to the x has an asymptote on the, along the x-axis at the line y equals 0. But because of the plus 1 in the equation, the asymptote will be at y equals 1. And because of the plus 1, the origin will now be moved up to 0, 1. And we'll plot that in orange. We'll call this the new origin. And points will be plotted relative to this new origin. Initial point is right 0, up 1, because e to the 0 power is 1. Right 1, up 2.7, because e is approximately 2.7. Right 2 up 7.4, e squared is approximately 7.4. Then going in the other direction, left 1 up about 0 0.4, the reciprocal of e is about 4 tenths. And then left 2 up 0 0.14, e to the negative 2 is approximately 0 0.14. We'll connect the points, we already have the asymptote there. And this is a graph of y equals e to the x plus 1. Let's compare it to the parent function, y equals e to the x, which is asymptote at the x-axis, y equals 0. And you can see that these two corresponding points from blue to green is up 1. Here from blue to green is up 1. And from the parent up to e to the x plus 1, also up 1, as it is along every point on the graph. A second way would be using a table. These are our five key points on a E, y equals e to the x graph. So we're going to add 1 to each of the y coordinates. So here the 7.4 will go up to uh, 8.4 and plotting 2 comma 8.4. 2.7 will go up to 3.7. 1 comma 3.7. 1 goes up to 2, 0, 2. Negative 1, comma, 1.4 will be our new point. And negative 2, comma, 1.14 will be our last point. We'll draw on the asymptote at y equals positive 1. And then we can go ahead and connect the points and get the exponential growth function. And there it is compared to the parent function.